one of you guys, if I told you what time it was right now, I'd have a lot of you guys. The ones that I tell to like, like on Twitter, for example, like, hey, you should be up and active. Like you should drink a lot of water. Like, you know, like when I tried my best to be like a good influence on you guys, you guys would not be proud of me right now. It is 11.30 a.m. right now. You know, it's okay to have that one or two nights a week where you kind of like sleep in. However, that being said, guys, I was up very late last night. It was like a four or five o'clock kind of night for me. I'm not proud of it. Look, I never go out. It was Josh's birthday, you know, I had to go support the boy. I was up late, got up late. But guys, it feels good to be back. It really does. I do miss you guys and I do miss vlogging. Vlogging was always something that was like very, like I like to keep it intimate with you guys and I like to have like that, I don't know, that FaceTime type of relationship with you guys. And I just like want to feel like I'm talking to you guys and it's nice. So that's what I'll be doing more often. Like I want to vlog and I want to do like fun stuff, but I also want to keep it like not every day is gonna be a roller coaster of events, you know? So just woke up, obviously you got ready for the gym. Um, I'm actually about to go with Larry. Larry and I have low-key like been hitting the gym together. We always start off with like walking on the treadmill, and it's nice because it's like just someone to talk to. Some cold water on the third. <laughs> I don't know why we're still at the in the bathroom. Let's let's go to the gym, y'all. When we come back from the gym, I'll run you guys through a little updated skincare routine. You guys excited for that? I'm, I am, I am. I don't know. Why I was gonna say I'm not. All right, so I'm on the way to the gym, and I stopped and got Larry and I a little coffee. I think it's an iced vanilla latte. I don't know. When I say I stopped and got them, Larry ordered them, and I picked them up. Uh, I don't even like coffee. It's the thought that counts. Like, thanks, Larry. Oh, guys, Sway pre-workout. Not available yet to you guys. However, it is coming out very soon on the shelves of GNC and a lot of supplement stores coming soon. I don't know the exact date. Don't, like, I don't want to say anything, so don't quote me on anything. But we have a lot of samples at the house. I'm not even being biased when I say this. I, like, look forward to working out every day just so I can drink that. It, it is quite literally one of the best things I've tasted. It's like blueberry lemonade, like that's the flavor. So we were gonna go to the gym, but then Larry was like, eh, I'm kind of feeling a hike. So we went hiking instead. Is this Kevin Wong? Like, are you paparazzi? Larry, Larry, Larry. Oh my, no, I do not. How was last night, Larry? I do not want to speak on that. We just got Jamba. So much Jamba. Honestly, I can tell you guys this right now. I what'd you, just, wait, what'd you get, what'd you get, what'd you get? I got a strawberry smoothie and it's the best thing in my entire life. I got a protein berry. With weight, weight Aren't protein. You yeah. Hey y'all, still drunk from last night. <laughs> you can record this button. Yeah. Oh. <gasps> oh my god. Is this slow zooming in? Yes. Do wait, you that's kind of like look, look. Wait, my camera's not ghetto. Hey. <laughs> no, it's ghetto. Oh. oh no, there's a lady right here. Larry, so, this is kind of far. I gotta get home. I have a call. <laughs> when your friends literally don't do anything for you besides. Larry, I do everything for you. <laughs> okay, why would you expose me? I ate you up. You ate me up. Guys, one time. But yeah, I'm I trying to vlog more because I really just like oh. love vlogging. Like YouTube's kind of been slow for me, you know? Mm. I just want to like, make videos that people like. I love her videos. Can you guys say hi to my vlog? Hi, vlog. Oh. She got camera shot. Humans are so boring. It's like, just have a good day. Okay, I'm gonna swing around this way. Where I are you taking me? Noah Beck is trying to kill me. Hey. What's up, guys? Just got back from the hike. Uh, just got done with the workout. Guys, I need to find a spot that I can set you guys. It's gonna be like my default spot. Mother trucker. I almost wanna face it this. Is that weird? Guys, usually what I try to do, what I tend to do with my showers, I try to do like, I start it with a nice, like, warm. Nice warm shower. Shampoo every like two days, I think, every two or three days. Condition quite often. Um, body wash every day, that's important. Um, and then yeah, that's about it. And then the last like 30 seconds, like when I know I'm about to get out, the last like 30 seconds of my shower, I tend to turn it like all the way cold. It's like not easy to like stand in like super cold water. It's like, it's like a, like an ice bath, right? And it kind of like gets you ready for the day. And like, in terms of like, look, this is probably like the hardest thing I'm gonna do today. Just fresh out of the shower, my face is dry now, so I'm gonna wet it a little. My skin's been really dry lately. I don't know. It's only about this LA water. LA water, air, it's it's not pretty. Putting some of this like serum on my face. It's like this Dior serum, gives you kind of like a glow. Yeah, so I got a podcast with Larry right now that I gotta go film. Um, I know you guys are excited for that, so am I. I'm putting some of this moisturizer on. I really don't know if I'm a huge fan of this moisturizer too much. It's so thick, like it's so thick where it like doesn't spread that well. But it's it's like good. Skin's getting a little bit of moisture back into it, which is good. And then, guys, this is like kind of like my secret ingredient here. Aquaphor, okay? It's not a brand deal or anything like that. Mm, I'll do that. And then, honestly, it says it's for dry, cracked, and irritated skin. 
That being said, why not use it kind of like a moisturizer? So I'll put some of this and I'll put it like where I usually get like a little irritated, which is like forehead, like around the nose area. And then I'll kind of like rub it in. My whole face at this time of the year gets kind of irritated. Oh, <laughs> no, I don't want to get demonetized or anything, but let's just say I tried to squirt my lotion and it squirted some in my hand and then the rest are on my pants right now. It does not look pretty. When I say like I'm, my skin's dry right now, I mean like everywhere. Like my freaking scalp is dry too. It's just like, it sucks. I don't know what it is, but it sucks. And it's not like a good feeling when your skin is dry because then it gets irritated and then you touch it and it's like, ah. And then I'll finish off with like a little gua sha. Why not? Like, scrape right here. Now guys, I'm not like an experienced gua sha user. So like, don't come at me if I'm doing this wrong. I literally just watched a YouTube video on it. And I'm not gonna lie, I don't swear by gua sha. I don't know if it works. It just kind of feels good. Hold on. I don't like it coming back and forth and like I keep like, but this is my problem is that like I have a lot of texts coming in and out from like, I have like five different like work group chats and they're always constantly texting me. And it's like, there's times of the day I don't want to be on my phone and like I want to unplug, but it's kind of hard to when it's like my job's on my phone. And so it's like the times I'm not on my phone, like, For Larry and I's podcast, it's kind of like we have this white and black theme going on. So let's look at my white shirts or should I wear like a white hoodie? Oh, wait, I'll wear this. This is cute. Oh, looky here. I haven't even worn it yet. Polo bear. This is my favorite. Like the, these sweaters, you can't go wrong with them. Look, look how cute they are. I'll layer that. Very, very casual, comfy fit today. I chose these. That is the coziest fit of all time. I'll literally wear the easy slides with it. Larry's grandma is coming on the podcast today. I'm super stoked. She's going to be a blast. Uh, her and Larry have like obviously a great relationship. She's been in front of camera before. She gets it. She gets it. I'm excited for today. Um, I don't know. I was just debating on what I should call her. I'm just, I think I'm just going to call her grandma. I'm just going to go with grandma. Hey, grandma. So that's what I'm going to do. Ah, oh, my hair looks kind of good right now. It dried very nicely. Kind of proud of it. Um, I don't think I need to put anything in it. I don't want to like ruin it. However, I do want to like put a little. This is like texture finishing dry, dry spray. Stuff is solid to be honest. I'm gonna text Larry. ETA question mark. We're supposed to be at the podcast studio in 12 minutes and 13 miles away in LA. That is with traffic and everything. Probably a good 30 minute drive, so we're gonna be late. I don't know if I'm gonna take you guys to the podcast. Literally, it's a studio and we sit there. When the podcast comes out, you guys will see what it looks like. I can't really explain it. I'm gonna be wearing white, Larry's gonna be wearing black, um, and his grandma's coming and we're just gonna talk. I don't know what about. But yeah, that being said, I love you guys and I will, I'll will i come back and I have the roast. I, I have a couple calls that I have to take. I don't know if I'm gonna do that with you guys, but I have the roast tonight with Bryce Hall. I'm in the audience, like I'm not even on the panel, I'm not roasting Bryce, cause like that's not like my thing, or I mean it could be, it'd be funny, but like at the same time, like they're like, no, are you coming? I'm like, I don't know why. And they're like, cause like a lot of people's roasts rely on you. And I'm like, what? Like, leave me out of this, right? But I, apparently everyone's like roasting me. So it's like, <laughs> roast the no, I guess. Just got done with the podcast, went really well. Larry's grandma is hilarious, and I'm sure you guys have seen her on his channel and all that. So after the podcast, me, Larry, and his manager went to Lemonade. It's like this food spot. It's like really freaking good. And I didn't know it was on my Uber Eats, so I'm probably gonna become a regular there. Eight, and now I'm back here. Uh, had some stuff in the mail, some packages. So I'm gonna do a little haul for you guys. Let me take y'all like this. Um, so in the mail came Dixie's uh, Christmas present that was a bit late, <laughs> just now came in. I like totally forgot because I got her a lot of other things. So I totally forgot about this one, but it's nice to see, I guess. It looks like it says mom, but it says wow. Like you could not tell me that doesn't look like mom. I know the explanation points are there, but it, this says wow guys. I promise it's not like for my mom. Merry Christmas, baby. I know how much you love to spend in that tub. Might as well spoil yourself. I love you. Soil? Soil yourself? I promise you I put spoil. I got her some like bath bombs. I got her some like skincare stuff. Like she loves to like, for like self care. And then I got these shoes, y'all. These New Balances. Like the grandpa style is like kind of in. And like, I, I don't know, I just love them. Could really dress them up, dress them down type thing. But I just wear them for anything. And y'all wanna see this stuff that I have? These came in too. It says woof woof. And it has like a phone number to call. I thought that was kind of wholesome. A cute shirt, but it also on the back has like a number you can call if you want to like adopt a pet. Like I thought that was so cool. Love that shirt, probably will be wearing it. And then, same idea, same premise here. I love cats. Same thing, we got the Balenciaga. I don't know when they did like this pet collab, but good for them. I love cats, Balenciaga, it's a hoodie. 
Same thing on the back. Meow. And then a number to call. How cool is that? Just kind of cute, you know? And they're really comfy. Balenciaga stuff is so comfy. But I got a pack, because I have a red eye tomorrow night. I'm sure I told you guys this, but I'm going to New York for uh, a coach photo shoot, which I'm super excited about. Guys, I kind of want to start streaming or doing something with this. So here's what I'm thinking. You guys want to hear my thought process? This couch, I could either put facing this way. Am I right? Like, so this corner is like strictly for like chilling or streaming or whatever it is. But I don't know. I don't know if I would like the couch right here facing this way because it kind of closes off this area, but it's also kind of cool. It's where I'm thinking right now. But in the meantime, if anything, I could put it out somewhere else in the house. And if I'm filming, if I'm streaming during the day, natural light, right? You guys get the idea? Desk facing this way, have like my whole streaming setup. I'm sitting here playing games like, like this, you know? This light, very dangerous. <laughs> I'm like perfectly missing it, but like also hitting it like my hair is hitting it. But if I got like a nice pair of like boots on, think maybe do something with that, I don't know. But that being said, if I had the streaming setup right here and the camera's facing this way, like streaming, live stream video, like gaming, whatever it may be, this area right here, I could decorate it in like a cool way that is like personalized for me and like it would be in the back of all my streams. I think that'd be cool. Figuring everything out. My room is, it's looking good. Got the roast tonight, I'm super stoked. It's a roast, right? Like you can't, I've been in my head, I'm like preparing myself. Like this is a Bryce Hall roast, but at the same time, like I said, guys, I don't know if I can make it tonight. They were like, they almost had a freaking panic attack on me. They were like, no, 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 like please, 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 like, you have to come. And like so many people's jokes rely on you being there. But I've been like mentally preparing myself. I'm like, what can they roast me on? No one like has anything on me. I don't have like this dark past that people are like digging up, you know? But that being said, I need to start packing for New York and got that tonight. So right now I'm probably just gonna play some Fortnite. Mm. Baby wanna sit, she can sit. Got your bank account in a cube. If she said it loud, it's the truth.